Hi there everyone. Just a quick update. It's raining out so this was the best place and also it's been a bit windy today. So this is probably the place to stay away from most of that. Vent hoses have come undone, so this side of the um, defrost isn't working, which is why I've been having to uh, squeegee it. Now for my channel, we've had a slew of subscribers this month, four, and that is a slew. I don't think there's ever been a, a month since I've been a YouTuber where there's been that many. <laughs> now obviously, bigger YouTubers are getting that per nanosecond, but I'm pretty happy with it. We're up to 60. Some of you I know, and most of you I don't know. So thanks for all that, and uh, keep subscribing. Now that I'm back to work, I don't make videos as frequently, uh, but I'm trying to change that and I at least want to get one out a week at least. So we'll see how that goes and uh, just have to build a routine around it somehow. Occasionally we get busy in the studio or whatever and there isn't as much opportunity, but we'll see. So I've been driving the 74 here, not exclusively, but 80% of the time I'd say. And I'm still kind of sussing out what's up with it. It's good. I got the front end done. Um, the rear springs need doing. Leaf springs. But I have to admit, it's kind of uh, it's kind of a luxury to have power steering, power brakes during the long commute. Now I don't want to pussy out. I got to keep a similar amount of mileage on both of the cars because otherwise, if I drive this one all the time and then I suddenly need the red one, who knows if it's just been sitting there? It's no good. So I'm going to try to get it to you know 50/50 or roughly the same. But this doesn't have nearly the class, but it's got a class all of its own. I mean, shit, it's got wood for Christ's sake, right? I'm going to kind of pimp this out all like just 70s, like beater, like probably like pretend like this is 1980 and some guy's got this, you know, wouldn't be that, that old at that time, but a 74, you know, been run hard, put away wet kind of thing. So. No fuzzy dice, but it really needs air. You know, actually, when I'm here, I should probably check, see if they've got any old-school pine air freshener, you know, 70s stuff. I bought some cassettes. Wind and Weathering by Genesis. I think that came out 76, so that's a good, uh, that's a good thing. And this was the first CD I ever had bought with my own money anyway. I'd had lots of LPs and uh, CDs prior, but the, with my first job money. And that's uh, 28 grades, Chuck Berry. Now, the only problem is the tape deck does work, but I would say the belt is gone and slipped. And uh, the wow and flutter is through the roof. I mean, it's like, it's completely fucked. But it sounds very interesting, and uh, Henderson and I are already working on some recordings that uh, either won't care about that or will be um, made better. So we'll see, we'll see what that's like. The wind and the weathering was was pretty good to listen to with the Wow. I mean, uh, it's kind of when the acid kicks in. But we're going up to the parts store. In order to do the timing on this, I need to be able to manually rotate the engine, and I don't have a uh, socket big enough to fit on the uh, the bolt that somebody has in the 
crank pulley. So that'll come in handy. Anyway, we'll be right back. I doubt we're going to catch anybody having a look in this piece, but you never know. There's freaks everywhere. I will see you all shortly. This car, they made it super awkward to get out the wiper. Um, and God help you if you if you do this. I mean, obviously you can, but if you have if you have you know, if you have to do something serious while you're doing that, it's gonna fuck your day. So yeah, that's that's really you know that's some that's some shitty design work going on right there. It seemed to work okay. I'm still working on the squirter there. But yeah, this is not, it's never comfortable to turn the wipers on and off. I may build a foot switch or some bullshit like that. Or a toggle over here that's easier to get at. Anyway. Uh, just to reiterate the uh, beginning of this video. Um, thanks everyone for your subscriptions. I don't get a lot of comments on... Uh, my chummies, but you're all welcome to comment um, questions or suggestions or anything like that. Um, I was mentioning we got four new subscribers in one 28-day period. That's that's a lot for this little channel. So we're up to 60. And uh, yeah, I I, I dig um, kind of making movies and talking with you guys. And uh, the more kind of feedback, the better. And uh, perhaps it'll give me some other types of ideas. I know a lot of things have been car related and well, <laughs> in the last year at least. But um, I try to get out and do nature videos or whatever as well sometimes. So there's a little bit of variety, but uh, recently been a lot of car stuff, I understand. And um, but yeah, some people are here for the car stuff, so they probably don't care. But um, give me some idea what you guys do like. And um, I'll try my best to see what is involved in uh, doing that and it'll it'll you know give me opportunity to do other kinds of stuff. Anyway, thanks again. Talk to you soon. Bye.